This is the red level 3 tape side 1. The red tapes help you learn the sound combinations that come at the end of words. And when you learn all these sound combinations, you'll be ready for the red workbook. Just by learning what's on these tapes, you'll be well on your way to becoming the best reader you can be. Do you have the red flashcards handy? If not, stop the tape and take them out of the red box. When you're ready with the flashcards, they're the ones with the red border and the hole for the white ring. Press the play button to start the tape again. Push the stop button now. Okay, are you ready to begin? Now, pick up the red deck of flashcards. Hold the deck in your hand with CH facing you. The red cards are numbered. One, two, and three. The letter names, the sound they make, and a word to read, you see? Let's read these cards together and learn them inside out. Concentrate on the letter sounds. That's what reading's all about. I'll say CH. Rich is what we'll say. Then play CH behind. TCH is on the way. Red cards. Ready? One, two, three, go. CH. Rich. TCH. Catch. SH. Fish. TH. Bath. NG. Mm. Song. MP. Mm. Camp. ND. Mm. And. NT. Mm. Ant. NK. Mm. Pink. ST. St. Fast. SP. Sp. Gasp. Your card should be in order with CH on top. If something's wrong or messed up, push that button stop. Let's do it again. Say what you heard. Read the letters, sound, and then the word. Red cards. Ready? One, two, three, go. CH. Rich. TCH. Catch. SH. Fish. TH. Bath. NG. Mm. Song. MP. Mm. Camp. ND. And. And. NT. And. And. NK. And. Pink. ST st, Fast SP sp, Gasp Do it again. Say what you heard. Read the letters, sound, and then the word. Red cards. Ready? One, two, three, go. C H ch, rich T C H ch, catch S H ch, fish T H bath N G mm, song M P mm, camp. ND and 
N T N T N T N K N K Pink S T St Fast S P Sp Gas One more time. As you heard, read the letters, sound, and then the word. Red cards. Ready? One, two, three, go. C H. Ch. Rich. T C H. Ch. Catch. S H. Sh. Fish. T H. Bath. Ng. Mm. Song. Mp. Mm. Camp. Nd. Mm. And. Nt. Mm. Ant. Nk. Mm. Pink. St. Fast. Sp. Sp. Gasp. Let's read these cards together and learn them inside out. Concentrate on the letter sounds. That's what reading's all about. This time, when we do it. Reading out loud as we go. Cover the word with your thumb to see how much you know. I'll say the letter names and you say the sound. Listen to me to see if you're right. Now another time around. Red cards ready. One, two, three, go. C H. T C H Ch S H Sh T H S N G N M P N P N D N T. Nt. Nk. Nk. St. St. Sp. Sp. Let's do it again and do it the same. Cover the word that's part of the game. Red cards. Ready? One, two, three, go. C H. Ch. T C H. Ch. S H. Sh. T H. N G N M P N P N D N N T N T N K N K S T S P S P How did you do? If you know these new sounds inside out, 
That means if you know all these sound combinations without guessing, you're ready to move on. But if not, rewind the tape and go through them again. Never move on to a new lesson until you know the old lesson inside out. This is so important. Take your time. There's no hurry. Have fun and learn at your own speed. You can do it. Stop the tape if you want to rewind it and go through these new sounds again. Then press the play button when you're ready to go on. Push the stop button now. This is the end of the red tape side one. Now fast forward this tape to the end, then turn it over to side two. I'll meet you there. This is the red tape side two. This tape will take us through the first half of the red workbook together. Parents, although this tape walks through each lesson, it's important for you to be there to guide and encourage your child. This tape will help you help your child work through each lesson. Well, do you know all the new sounds on side one of the red flashcards inside out? Do you know them without guessing? If you do, then you're ready to move on. But if you're not sure you're sure of them, why not go through them one more time without my help? Knowing the new sounds inside out is so important for learning to read. Remember, there's no hurry. And with a little more practice, you'll be on your way. Do you want to practice? Stop the tape. Then press the play button to start the tape again when you're ready for the red workbook. Push the stop button now. Are you ready? Put the red flashcards away in the red box for now. You'll need them later and I'll tell you when. Go ahead and get the red workbook and open it to page 4. Stop the tape, then press the play button again when you're ready to start. Push the stop button now. Do you have the red workbook open to page 4? This is the first sounding out words page in this workbook. Let's sound out and read all the words on page 4 together. We're going to start with the top of the page. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number 1. Slide your finger over to the first word, rich. And let's read across the line out loud together. Rich. Slide. Which. Slide. Such. Slide. Much. Now let's read the bottom of the page together. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number one. Slide your finger over to the first word, catch. And let's read across the line out loud together. Catch. Slide. Batch. Slide. Hatch. Slide. Latch. Slide. Match. Slide. Patch. Good. Let's read line two. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number two. Slide to the word snatch and read with me. Snatch. Slide. Ditch. Slide. Hitch. Slide. Witch. Slide. Pitch. Slide. Notch. Now line three. Slide to the word Dutch. Dutch. Slide. Clutch. Slide. Fetch. Now let's read the next page, page five. This is a review page. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number one. Slide over to the word such and read out loud with me. Ready? Such, slide, which, slide, much, slide, rich, slide, which. Good. Let's read line two. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number two. Slide to the word catch and read with me. Catch, hatch, ditch. Pitch. Match. Now line three. Is your finger on the arrow next to the number three? Slide to the word 
patch, ready, patch, snatch, hitch, clutch, latch. Good. Now line four. Batch, notch, fetch. Now that we've read pages four and five together, I want you to go back and read these two pages over again. But this time, I want you to read without my help. Go back to the top of page four, and then by yourself read all the words across line one. When you're finished reading the top of page four, read the bottom of the page. Stop the tape. Then press the play button when you're finished reading page four. Push the stop button now. Now read page five all by yourself, just the way we did it together. Stop the tape. Then press the play button when you're ready to go on. Push the stop button now. Turn to page six. Now you're ready for the first story in this workbook. It's called Play Ball. Read this story out loud all by yourself. Then we'll read the story a second time together. Stop the tape. Then press the play button when you're finished reading the story. Push the stop button now. Did you like the story? Now let's read it together. Play ball. Rich steps up to bat. Ann will pitch. Pitch the ball, Ann. Rich yells. Rich slugs it. Ann cannot catch it. Sam fetch it. Rich yells. Sam runs to get the ball. He hops into the ditch. He grabs it. Sam runs back to Rich. What a catch, Sam! One more time now. Read it again, okay? You don't need me for this. And then you can read the story to your family and to your friends and show them what you can do. Stop the tape. Then, when you've read the story a few times, press the play button to start the tape again. Remember to place a sticker on your My Reading Adventure poster when you're finished. Push the stop button now. Let's turn to page eight, the next sounding out words page. From now on, we're going to read just the sounding out words pages together. Each time we finish one, I want you to stop the tape and read the following review page all by yourself. Then go on and read both the sounding out words page and the review page again without my help. Let's try it now with pages eight and nine. Page eight. Let's read out loud together. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number one on the top of the page. Slide your finger over to the first word, cash, and let's read across the line out loud together. Cash. Dash. Mash. Rash. Smash. Stash. Now let's read line two. Place your finger on the arrow next to the number two. Slide to the word clash and read out loud with me. Ready? Let's go. Clash. Trash. Flash. Fish. Wish. Dish. Ready for line three? Hush. Mush. Rush. Blush. Crush. Fresh. Now place your finger on the arrow next to the number one on the bottom of the page. Slide your finger over to the first word, bath. And let's read across the line out loud together. Bath. Path. Math. Moth. Cloth. Broth. Now line two. Beth. Good. Now read the review page on your own. Stop the tape. 
Then when you're finished reading page 9, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Do you have a pencil or a crayon handy? If not, stop the tape and get one. And we can have fun with this review page. Press the play button when you're ready. Push the stop button now. Now, can you find the three words that start with the cool sound? Cool. Draw a circle around each of them. Read the words out loud. Stop the tape, then when you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a circle around clash on line 2, cloth on line 3, and clutch on line 5? Good! Now can you find the word that means something you take in a tub to get clean that sometimes has lots of bubbles? Here's a hint. It's on line 3. Draw a box around it. Read it out loud. Stop the tape. Then when you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a box around bath? Good! Now, I want you to go back and read pages 8 and 9 over again for practice all by yourself. So go back to the top of page 8 and then all by yourself read all the words across lines 1, 2, and 3. When you finish reading the top of the page, read the bottom of the page. Stop the tape, then press the play button when you're finished reading page 8. Push the stop button now. Finished reading page 8? Now read page 9 again by yourself. Stop the tape, then press the play button when you're finished. Push the stop button now. Now let's learn some more words. Let's read the next Sounding Out Words page, page 10. Are you ready? Let's sound out and read all the words on page 10 together. Line 1. Hang. Rang. Bang. Sang. Clang. Thing. Line 2. Swing. Sting. Fling. Bring. Sing. Song. Line 3. Long. Rung. Lung, hung, sung. Stop the tape. Then when you're finished reading review page 11 all by yourself, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Now I want you to read pages 10 and 11 again on your own. When you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Here's a new story. This one's called, When the Class Bell Rings. Turn to page 12 and try reading it without my help. Then you can read it to your friends and your family. When you've read the story a few times, press the play button to start the tape again. Push the stop button now. Now turn to page 14. Let's read the Sounding Out Words page together. Line 1 on the top of the page. Camp. Damp. Lamp. Champ. Stamp. Clamp. Ready for line 2? Cramp. Tramp. Limp. Skimp. Blimp. Lump. Line 3. Pump, bump, dump, jump, thump, slump. Now line one on the bottom of the page. And, band, hand, land, sand, stand. Line two. Brand, 
bond, fond, pond, blonde, mend. Line three, send, end, bend, lend, spend, blend. Now read review page 15 on your own. When you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Let's have some fun with this review page. Can you find the words that end with the th sound? Th. Draw a circle around them. Now read the words out loud. Stop the tape and then press the play button when you're finished. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a circle around math and broth on line 5? Good! Now, can you find the word that means the opposite of sit? Draw a box around it. Read it out loud. Stop the tape. Then when you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a box around stand on line 2? Stand is the opposite of sit. Now, when you're finished reading pages 14 and 15 again all by yourself, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Turn to page 16. It's time for another story. It's called Clap and Jump. Read this story without my help and then read it to your family and friends. Stop the tape then when you're finished reading the story a few times, press the play button. Push the stop button now. We're up to page 18 now. How far you've come! These are the first helper word ladders in the red workbook. Remember, helper words help you to read. They're words that are used a lot in books, and many of these words cannot be sounded out. The more of them you know, the more stories you can read. First, we'll climb up the ladders together. Then you'll climb the ladders on your own. Remember to reach for the stars. The new helper words are always on ladder one. And there are always helper words to practice on helper word ladders two, three, and four. Place your finger on the arrow above the number one. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. Goes. Read it with me goes. Now slide your finger up the ladder to the next helper word. His. His. Slide up. Make. Make. Slide up. Out. Out. Slide up. Was. Was. You've reached the star. Let's climb ladder one again together. Ready? Place your finger on the arrow above the number one. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. Goes. Slide. His. Slide. Make. Slide. Out. Slide. Was. You've reached the star. Once again, ready? Place your finger on the arrow above the number one. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. Goes. Slide. His. Slide. Make. Slide. Out. Slide. Was. You've reached the star. Now place your finger on the arrow above the number two. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. Down. Slide. First, slide, so. You've reached the star. Place your finger on the arrow above the number three. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. They, slide, say, slide, from, slide, her. You've reached the star. Now place your finger on the arrow above the number four. Slide your finger up to the first helper word. Thank. Slide. There. 
slide, come, slide, have. You've reached the star. Now stop the tape and practice all the helper words on this page without my help. Read them up and down and down and up and jump from one ladder to another ladder for fun. When you're finished practicing, press the play button. Push the stop button now. It's time for pile up. Do you remember how to play? Take helper word cards 35 through 49 out of the card pouch in the red box. Stop the tape. Then when you're ready, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Okay now, your parent or a friend will show you one card at a time. Try to read the word on each card out loud. Whenever you read the word correctly, you get to keep the card. And if you miss a word, give it a second try. If you miss it again, go on to the next card. Watch the pile of cards grow as you learn these words. When you're finished playing Pile Up, the cards go back in the card pouch to save them for next time. Stop the tape, and when you're finished playing the game, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Turn to page 19. It's time for the first hot book of this level. Get hot book 19 out of the red box. This book is called The Race. Can you guess which car will win the race? Read the book out loud. Have fun with it. And when you're done, read the book again to your family and friends. After you've read the book a few times, press the play button. Remember to place a sticker on your My Reading Adventure poster when you're finished. Parents, it's important to help your child think about ideas in the story while reading. Each time your child reads a hot book, take some time to talk about it. You can use the questions on this page or make up your own questions to help your child understand the book. Push the stop button now. Are you back in the red workbook with me? Now let's read a sounding out words page, page 20. Are you ready? Line 1 on the top of the page. Ant. Pant. Slant. Plant. Hint. Mint. Line 2. Print. Hunt. Punt. Stunt. Blunt. Grunt. Line 3. Bent. Dent. Rent. Sent. Tent. Went. Now line 1 on the bottom of the page. Sank. Tank. Bank. Thank. Blank. Crank. Line two. Pink. Mink. Sink. Wink. Think. Drink. Line three. Dunk. Hunk. Junk, chunk, skunk, trunk. Stop the tape and read the words on the review page all by yourself. When you're finished reading page 21, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Remember to read the sounding out words page and review page again all by yourself. Stop the tape, then when you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Here's sounding out words page 22. Let's read out loud together. Line 1 on the top of the page. Fast. Last. Mast. Past. Blast. Fist. Line 2. List. Lost. Dust. Rust. 
just, trust, line three, crust, rest, west, best, nest, chest, line one on the bottom of the page, gasp, rasp, grasp, Clasp, lisp, wisp. Remember to read the review page without my help. Stop the tape, then when you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Let's have some fun with this review page. Draw a circle around the two words that end with the sh sound, sh, and read them out loud. Stop the tape, then when you're ready, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a circle around stash on line four and blush on line five? Good. Now here's a puzzle for you. Can you find the word that means the place in which a baby bird is born? Here's a hint. The word is on line one. Draw a box around the word that solves the puzzle. Read it out loud. Stop the tape. Then when you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a box around the word nest on line one? Now remember to read pages 22 and 23 again for practice. Then press the play button. Push the stop button now. Turn to page 24. Here's a new story. This one's called The Hunt for the Lost Chest. It's a story and a game. Read it out loud all by yourself. Use your finger to trace the path while you read the words and the signs out loud. Then do it again for practice and for fun. Stop the tape, then press the play button when you're finished reading the story a few times. Push the stop button now. Turn to page 26. Remember how wordplay goes? Take the black and white wordplay cards out of the card pouch in the red box. Next, with help from someone in your family or a friend, follow the step-by-step -step instructions on the page. Stop the tape. Then when you're finished with the game, press the play button. Push the stop button now. How are you doing? Remember, you don't have to hurry along. You can go as fast or as slowly as you like. You can always stop the tape and go back and read your favorite hot books again. When you're ready to move on, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Turn to page 27, the first workbook review in this workbook. Workbook reviews help you practice many of the words you've learned so far. And you have learned a lot of words. There's no hurry. Take it easy. You can do it. When you're finished, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Let's have some fun with this workbook review. Draw a circle around all of the words that end with sp, sp, and read all those words out loud. Stop the tape, then when you're ready to go on, press the play button. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a circle around clasp, grasp, lisp, rasp, and wisp? Good! Now, can you find the word that means something that grows outside? Draw a box around it, then read it out loud. Stop the tape, then press the play button when you're ready to move on. Push the stop button now. Did you draw a box around plant on line four? Good. Now, if you know these words inside out, you're ready to move on. But if you're guessing at some of the words, rewind the tape and repeat any of the lessons you're not sure you know. Never move on to a new lesson until you know the old ones inside out. Stop the tape. Then when you're ready to go on, press the play button. Push the stop button now. 
We're on page 29. Get Hot Book 20 out of the red box. It's called Mad Dog. Read it out loud. Have fun with it. And when you're done, read the book again to your family and friends. After you've read the book a few times, press the play button. Parents, each time your child reads a hot book, take some time to talk about it. You can use the questions listed on this page or make up your own questions to help your child understand the book. Push the stop button now. This is the end of the red tape side two. Stop this tape and remove it from your cassette player. Then insert the red tape side three and press the play button. I'll meet you there. Push the stop button now.